Hey guys, it's Jackie. I hope you're all doing well. So I finally have my Scentsy box here at my house. So I'm going to unbox it for you guys. But I want to show you a sweet, sweet, sweet young lady sent me two candles. You guys, so kind. So very kind. The first one she sent me is the New York Cherry Cheesecake. You guys know this candle is my jam. But just wait for it. She also sent me a gooey marshmallow. I literally, you guys have no idea. So thank you very, very much. She also sent me a super cute little letter. Um, so sweet. So thank you, Haley. You are amazing. So kind. What a kind heart. She had some really awesome words to say. And exactly why I do my YouTube channel is what you guys tell me, like my upbeat personality, who I am, my positivity, and that, you guys, means the world to me. So, thank you, Haley. So, I got some newness from Scentsy. And just a small update, I probably will not be selling Scentsy anymore. If I get any, I'll probably get it from my uh, friend, Thomas Harmon. So if you don't know who I'm talking about, you can go over and check out his YouTube channel. He is a Scentsy consultant. Um, so I probably will be ordering from him. I just, I don't want to keep it up. And it's really hard um, because then I'm tempted, you know, to keep buying. And it's just, I, I literally went through my Scentsy stuff in my basement. And I was so overwhelmed by how much wax I have. I have tons of warmers and it's just, it feels like more of a hassle than it was getting to be fun anymore. I might go back to it. I don't know, but at this point I think I'm done. So this might be my last Scentsy haul, like my biggest haul. I picked up two more of these, of the light side of the force. This was part of the Star Wars. This scent came with Chewbacca, the scent buddy. So I wanted to have two in backup before you could no longer get them because it smells so good. I have my Chewbacca in my bed. So I have my Olaf and my Chewbacca. They're both scent buddies and I keep them by my head and they just smell so good. So I wanted to have a couple of them in backup and it smells really yummy. So I'll just keep them in their pack until, you know, I need them. My Olaf one has lasted over a year. I think I had told you guys that. So. I got two more of those, and then I picked up two of these. Um, they're the Buddy Clips. It's Hobo the Cat. I'm a cat fan. You guys know that. Ooh. The scent is Sun Kiss Citrus. Look how cute this little Buddy Clip is. It's got the little Scentsy logo on the bottom. The legs are corduroy. Super cute little kitty. Um, I like to keep one of these in my car. I have Stella the Unicorn in there right now, but this smells, the scent is mostly in her little belly. So these were on sale. I had a um, some hostess credits. Um, I had closed my own party as the consultant and the host. So I had picked up a couple of items. So a lot of these things I got either half off or with hostess credit. So I got this little guy. I thought it was so cute. So this is Buddy Clip Hobo the Cat. The other one I picked up is a blue, blue, berry fairy tail, and it's Calypso the Unicorn Buddy Clip. I cannot wait to see her. Ooh, that smells really good. Look how cute she is. And she's got a little heart and a star, two hearts and stars on her little bottom. I wonder where the Scentsy logo is. Well, that's different. Huh. Oh, it's on her little foot, little Scentsy thing. And then she's got a heart in between her eyes with her little unicorn. She smells good. Berry fairy tale. I think that's a current wax right now. So I picked up both of those. They were... I want to say both like $11 if I'm not mistaken. So I got those. Then I picked up several waxes. So I was really excited because some of these are Bring Back My Bars and some of them are brand new and that I hadn't smelled. So Twitter Pated, um, you guys know this is one of my favorite Disney scents with the Bambi collection. It smells so good. This wax is probably one of my favorites. And now that I said that I probably won't sell Scentsy again, and then I start getting excited and start smelling everything, and then I'm like, oh, maybe I'll still do it. Oh, 
Next one I got is pistachio ice cream. I only picked up, okay, so I picked up two Twitter pateds because I didn't want to be without this one in case I didn't sell Scentsy anymore. So that's, I was trying to figure out which ones I had gotten doubles of. So I have to, I think those are the only one I got double. So pistachio ice cream, it was a bring back my bar. So I wanted to smell it because if a lot of people voted this back into existence, I said, you know, I gotta see what this is all about. If I could get it out. Oh, it smells like ice cream, the pistachio ice cream. Also with a little bit of vanilla. Ooh, that smells really good. That might be a good kitchen scent. So I picked that one up. Another bring back my bar was called African Mahogany. I think that's the only one yet. So it's this one. I've never smelled this one before. It's different. I like to pop the wax out of the cube. It smells like men's cologne. It's kind of woodsy and musky at the same time. And it's a very masculine scent. That smells good. I feel like I'm getting stuffed up. So I apologize if I have a whistle or if it's just my allergies. Um, this one is Wasail. I don't know if I'm saying that right. It's W-A-S-S-A-I-L. I don't know. It was another bring back my bar. So I had to have it. Well, I can see why this was a, why this one, this smells like caramel apple. I don't know if that's what they were going for. It's like a caramel apple bread. It's very bakery. That smells good too. Wow. Now I can see. I got banana rama. So I was really excited about this. It's going to smell like bananas. Yeah. Literally smells like a banana. Laffy Taffy banana. That smells really good. So I wanted to see how that one would warm. I wasn't quite sure. Another one that was a bring back my bar is Ice Hotel. I don't ever remember this one. That's very fresh. <laughs> very fresh. It's kind of spa. Like it smells like a spa. With a very pretty flower. But not too flowery. That's nice. Ooh, you're getting Jackie notes. Crisp Orchard Air. I think this is going to smell like apples too. Another bring back my bar. Nope. Doesn't smell like an apple. That's weird. It smells... Ooh. I don't know. It's kind of got a berry scent to it. With like, not a spice, but very... That's very pretty. I think these are all still available this month. So you'll have to go check out that... Um, apple press I was interested in. It smells just like an apple with a little bit of spice. Ooh, I'm excited. And then luscious lemon, I think it's going to smell just like a lemon. Yep. Lemon. It smells like a lemon drop. Like the hard candy lemon is exactly what that smells like. Little pine saw. Yeah. Little undertone of pine saw. And then a perfect oatmeal. That was another bring back my bar. I wanted to smell. It does not smell like oatmeal. At least not any of the oatmeals I eat. I don't eat that much oatmeal. Let's not kid myself. Let's see. I don't know if you guys heard that. I heard a car. It does not smell like oatmeal. It smells like an oatmeal raisin cookie. It just says perfect oatmeal. I mean, it's not bad. I don't know that I'd get this one again. I'd have to warm it to see, you know, how I feel about it. So those were the scent uh, waxes that I got. So that's all the scents. And then I picked up this really cute warmer because I had seen my friend Thomas Harmon. He had done something really cute with this warmer for Christmas. So let me open it. This is for me. This is not for a customer or anything. I'm pretty selfish. I buy it for myself. I don't know. They, they package their stuff like really, really well. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get that out. Huh. Well, I'll be, I mean, I'm going to destroy the pack. Now I got these little, wow, you guys are seeing these struggle. The struggle is real. It's a lit warmer. There's the lid. 
and the bulb should be in here somewhere. Oh, <laughs> it's like, oh look, I got a new bracelet. This is getting to be a great video. So it's a lit warmer and it's this little galvanized barn. And what Thomas did at Christmas is that he put a little wreath on it to make it Christmassy. So you could change this for like all the different seasons. So it's galvanized. Here's the top of the barn. And I don't know why, if I ever were to build a house, I would build a house in the barn shape. And so you would turn, you know, plug it in. I guess that's both ways. No, maybe not. There you go. No, it doesn't. Okay, so there's how the lid goes on. And then it's really super cute. So he had to like put a little wreath here for Christmas and it was so adorable. Um, I can plug it in for you guys too. So I had been eyeballing this for a little while. I had, um, I had two warmers that um, they weren't working for me anymore and I didn't feel like dealing with them. So I did recycle them. So I felt like it was okay for me to purchase another warmer. I don't know if that makes any sense to anybody else, but look how pretty. I don't know that that's how that goes on. Oh. There we go. I think, I don't know why I feel like it should go this way. I'll have to play with that to see, because I feel like it should be like that, but it's not sitting on there properly. Wonder if mine's bent. It could also be the way I took it out of the package. But look how cute that is. I was really excited about that. So I wanted to get that. I did get it half off because, like I said, I closed a party. Anyways, I hope you guys are doing good. I hope you enjoyed the Scentsy haul. I'm on the fence of whether or not I'm going to continue selling it. I'm kind of over it, but I'm kind of not because I'll miss it. I don't know. I'll have to keep you guys updated. I hope you guys are doing well, and I will talk to you soon. Bye!